there, welcome to episode, I think it's 19, yes, 19, of the HZ of Nez here on Super Retroid. We've finished the adventures of Lolo, now we're on the adventures of Rad Gravity, also just known as Rad Gravity, the adventures part. Boom, bing, boom. Ooh, pretty colours. Wow, it's so nice to see a nice selection of colours, not just browns and greens. Do you know who he reminds me of? He looks like uh, Bruce Campbell from the Evil Dead films. That is crazy. Oh god. Um, kudos though for them to get in the character in the game, looking like the character in like the menu screen. I mean, well done for that. At least he looks like you're expecting. But what the fuck is the level about? It it looks futuristic. I'll give them that. But. But <laughs> uh, I guess we're on a foreign world, so the the language is in uh, a foreign language. That's fine. I can handle that. I just don't know what anything is. Where on earth do they design? Who's the designer of this city? I mean, geez, they've gone right. We don't need think people to walk along the floor. We need them to uh, be on top of buildings. Um, why are they out to kill you? Uh, Jesus Christ. Why is this guy called Rad Gravity? I mean, I'm guessing it's the adventures of him. I'm guessing his name is... Well, they tell you his name is Rad. Who the fuck named him Rad? Even in the space in two million years' time? That's not going to be a cool name, is it? His parents should be ashamed. They really should. Call him their son Rad. Jesus, call him Brad or something. Call him fucking Dave. Not bloody Rad. And their last name's Gravity. Jesus, if your last name is Gravity, they call him, I don't know, uh, Defy. Defy Gravity, awesome name, or um, fuck you, fuck you Gravity, or I'll give up. I do like how <laughs> when you hit somebody they explode into four pieces and fly off the screen. Yeah! That's magic, that's what that is. I mean his sword, or whatever the hell it is, I'm guessing it's a take on a lightsaber. Oh <laughs> look at that, limbs go everywhere, this guy is a bastard. And not only is he really strong, he can hit somebody and bits of their body go all over the place. He's a freaking masochistic son of a bitch. Look, look, he's going around just chopping people up. What is that? That looks like a walking spaghetti monster. That's all I can say. Do we have spaghetti monsters in the future? Must do. This this game would not lie. Oh god, this sucks. It, it wouldn't be so bad. I know you can... They're walking really slow, but you have to get up close to hit them, and you're gonna take a hit. Good luck, Rad. <laughs> Good luck, Dave. I hate this game already. Oh, it's another headache inducer, I'm telling you. Anyway, thanks for watching. Tune in next time for the adventures of Tom Sawyer.